There were 50 police at my lecture on Wednesday night. If there had been a bomb thrown, I would surely have been blamed for it. If I can dance, then I don't want to be a part of your revolution. The history of human growth and development is at the same time the history of the terrible struggle of every new idea heralding the approach of a brighter dawn. How is the ordinary man to know that the most violent element in society is ignorance, that its power of destruction is the very thing anarchism is combating? Anarchism urges man to think, to investigate, to analyze every proposition. The sea was terrifying and fascinating. The freedom from home, the beauty and wonder of the endless expanse in its varying moods, and the anticipation of what the new land would offer stimulated my imagination and sent my blood tingling. I stood enraptured by the side of the harbor and the Statue of Liberty suddenly emerging from the mist. Ah, there she was. She held her torch high to light the way to the free country, the asylum for the oppressed of all lands. We, too, would find a place in the generous heart of America. Our spirits were high, our eyes filled with tears. It was May 1892, and news came from Homestead of trouble between Carnegie Steel and its organized employees. Carnegie turned over management to Henry Clay Frick, who announced no more agreements and closed the mills. Pinkerton slaughtered steel workers. It was an open declaration of war. The sympathy of the entire country was with the man. My Sasha was the first on his feet. The great moment has come at last. It was not only for the moment that they must strike, but for all time, for a free life, for anarchism. Russia had many heroic men and women, but who was there in America? I do not believe in marriage. I believe that when two people love each other, that no judge, minister or court or body of people have anything to do with it. They themselves are the ones to determine their relations. Anarchism holds everything for woman. Freedom, equality, everything that woman has not now. The alliance should be formed not to give the woman a, a support and home, but because the love is there. And that state of affairs can only be brought about by an internal revolution. In short, anarchy. To learn more about Emma Goldman's life of rebellion and struggle, visit jewishlives.org for more information and to purchase Vivian Gornick's Emma Goldman Revolution as a Way of Life, available now.